What's up, gorgeous people? This is Amazars DIY and other stuff. My name is Amber Meeks, and in today's video, I have my May Heroes Tower Mystery Box. So you guys just saw me unbox the April box just last week, and this one came, like, I think the next day or maybe later that day, right after I filmed that video. So I'm really excited to see what's inside this one. So we're going to get this one open today, and I will have the April Craft Challenge results. I will have the June Challenge item, and I'm going to have another giveaway. As I told you guys, I increased my Patreon support for this company. I just love Chad. I love this box. I think it is absolutely fantastic. So after I increased my Patreon support, he let me know that I was at a tier level where I get a free mini box each month. I'm going to pass that off to you guys each and every single month. So we have a lot to cover. Without further ado, let's jump into what I got in my May box. Okay, guys. So Woo! <laughs> Here's my box. I am so super stoked. Let's open this bad boy up. Take the bubble wrap away. So here is their flyer. They have some information about their company. You can order for this box on Cratejoy. Now they might be sold out. And if they are sold out, just make sure that you check periodically because there may be a time when they're not. So I'm going to go ahead and fold this up because I don't want to see what I got. I want to be surprised. But I'm not going to lie to you guys. This is my second time opening the box. So I did see this. I saw this part, but nothing else. Okay. So we have the Raiders of the Lost Ark comic book. Here it is. That's going to be super fun. I'm sure there's me a lot of some fun things that I can use in here for crafting. So we'll set that aside. Ooh, the June craft challenge item. We'll set that aside. What is this? Okay, this is the mystery box. Ooh, DC themed. That should be fun. Oh, what if I want what's in there? Oh boy. Hmm. I hope that I don't. Okay, so this is the craft item. So that's for the craft item challenge. All right, ooh, what is this? Oh, you guys, it's a handmade bag that's Avengers. Ah, I'm so super stoked. Oh my gosh, you guys, I love these bags. I have a couple of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle ones, and I use them literally all of the time. I use them as decorative storage for all of the things that I haven't been able to get to yet, so I will do the same with this. And there's some goodies inside, so I'm super stoked. Oh my gosh, I am so excited, guys. This bag is so incredibly awesome. I'm really stoked to have that. Okay, I'll sit this here. I don't want to get myself lost here. Oh, look, we got a Tinkerbell keychain. You know, I know somebody that would probably like to have this, and I might pass it off to them, and if they watch this video, they'll know exactly who they are. Check it out. How cute. Yeah, I might pass this off to my friend. We'll have to see. That is super fun though. I love it. Okay. And then we have some goodies in here. Let's go ahead and open those up. I don't want to take too much of you guys this time, but I want to enjoy this unboxing as well. So in every single box, he includes a postcard along with the postage stamp so that you can send somebody geeky hello. I think that is super fun. This time we have Aquaman. How fun is that, guys? <laughs> I love it. Now, you're supposed to send somebody a geeky hello, but, you know, I never do that. I'm going to have a craft project that I'm going to do with these, and you guys are going to see that eventually. And then I have a really fun Spider-Man magnet. How fun is this, you guys? This is also a handmade item. That is one of the things that sold me on this box. I love the fact that Chad is a crafter. It just really, really makes me so super happy to have a fellow crafter that has a subscription box. Okay, what is going on here? Oh my gosh, this is this is too fun. I mean, this is way too fun. I love this. So we have a Scooby-Doo Lego set. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm going to have some fun with this. Now, most people would give this to their kid. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to put it together and I'm going to put it in my geeky area and it's going to be absolutely fabulous. This is so fun. Guys, I love that. That is really, really super fun. Okay, so this is upside down. I got another one of those Funk Popo things and I can't get enough of them. I'm so excited that he, he has these to give to me and I don't know what we have this time. So let's check it out. Oh, <laughs> oh stop it. Stop it. This is fun. Oh my gosh, this is so fun. It's Inspector Gadget. I can't. I can't. Just stop it now. This is fabulous, guys. Look at it. Oh my gosh, I can't. That is absolutely fabulous. Let's take him out. Oh, I can't. This is so fun, you guys. Oh my gosh, we just popped out of there. That is so great. Ah, oh, you guys remember this? I can't. I cannot. Look at that. Oh my gosh, that is absolutely fabulous. I mean, 
and it's really fabulous. Let me turn them around for you guys. Oh my gosh, I can't. This is so, so, so super fantastic. Oh my gosh, I love it. That is great. Oh, that is so fun. Okay, so that wraps up everything for my box for this month. So let's go ahead and jump into what the craft challenge results are and then what the craft challenge item will be for this next month. <laughs> Okay guys, so I know I look way different from the way that I started the video and the way that I'm going to end the video, but to be honest with you guys, I'm filming this on a completely different day because when I unboxed that, I unboxed it like you know, shortly after I got it because I'm so excited to see what's inside, but I had didn't have my craft item ready yet. So I didn't want to unbox any of the craft stuff until I had my craft item ready. So it is ready now. So you're seeing me as I am literally every day, all day. This is my actual hair. This is no wig guys. Yeah, this is all my hair this time. So I don't have a wig in or anything like that. This is what you would see if you lived near me and you stopped by my house during the week. This is what I would most likely look like. All right, guys, enough of all that stuff because nobody really cares. Let's see what awesome craft Chad made for the May craft challenge. And then we'll see what I made for the May craft challenge. And then I will see what he has in store for the June craft challenge. Okay. So let's go ahead and start with Chad's item here. As you guys can see, I didn't unbox it yet or anything like that. It says this way up. So hmm, let's see what's going on in here. All right. Oh, bubble wrap. It's nice. This is the top. Okay, we're gonna open this up, guys. <laughs> I haven't opened it yet. I have no idea what awesome thing he came up with, but I bet it's way better than mine. Okay, let's see. What? What? Oh, Chad, you nailed it. Okay, guys, so this is Iron Man. And he created like some type of environment for Iron Man to be flying above with the little stone piece. See, here's the stone piece that he sent to me, the exact same one. He created this awesome environment to put Iron Man on for him to fly on. Oh my gosh, you guys, this thing is freaking amazing. Let me let you see it from the front. Here's the front part of it. Oh my gosh, this thing is so cool. <gasps> he came up with something really, really awesome. He definitely put a lot of thought and work into this. Here's the back of it. This thing is so super cool, guys. He hands down won this one. I can tell you that right now. He definitely has the best craft. I absolutely love this thing. Oh, this is so cool. I can't wait to put this in my geeky area. Okay, guys, so don't make fun of me. Listen, I'm going to pop some pictures up for you of what I was thinking when I did this. So remember the stickers that I got, the Octagon Avenger stickers that he sent in the um, box that I opened with this craft challenge item? Well, I used those stickers and it's like the easiest craft in the world, but it's going to look so cool the way that I'm going to have it displayed in my geeky area. So here it is, guys. <laughs> This is my craft. I literally just stuck that Thor sticker on top and I was going to Mod Podge it, but these are really good, strong stickers. So there was no need to Mod Podge. So I just literally put the Thor sticker right over top of that. And this is actually a flat bottom here. So this actually sits really well without it having any kind of stand because I was going to put it on a stand. Then I was going to put it on like a cup and all this other stuff. But I thought, you know what? I just want to leave it like this. So I'm going to pop some pictures up, guys. I'm going to have um, it displayed in my geeky area with like a super fun lightning background. And I'm going to add one of those um, Thor, what are those things called? Keychains, Thor keychain hammers. I'm going to put that with it and have like accessories. And I might find like a little helmet and stuff like that because I want to do a really nice cool Thor area. And I thought this would be perfect for that. So that was my thought process with this. So like a lot more goes into this to make it look really nice rather than just sticking a sticker on a piece of... Uh, whatever this is, right? So I love the idea that I'm able to use it this way. And I honestly wish I had a few more pieces like this because I would do the other characters as well. But what Chad came up with, come on guys. I mean, I don't even have to ask you what your favorite one is this time. Clearly it's this one. That is 100% certain. But I do like my idea for this with the background and everything. And I can kind of highlight Thor because I really love this sticker. I think that it looks more like what you would picture Thor to look like. So I think this is an excellent sticker. I think it's a really cool way for me to be able to display Thor. But come on, guys. Hands down. 
this one wins, right? I'm just saying. You guys don't even have to comment below what your favorite is. It's this one. I know. <laughs> awesome job, Chad. That is super fun. Okay, guys. So let's go ahead and check out the June craft challenge item. His note does let me know that it is stickers. It says stickers. You may use one or as many stickers as you like to craft something to craft something good luck okay let's see what fun stickers he sent me because i do like to work with stickers i have tons of ideas for stickers so this is a good way for me to be able to use stickers more effectively than than this i'm just saying it, it'll be more exciting guys <laughs> but i really didn't want to do anything else to that i don't know i just really like the way that looks so i did it that way okay here we go guys what do we have Ooh! We got Wonder Woman um, 3D stickers. Okay, very cool. I've had ideas for these for a while, so this will be an excuse to make sure that I make something pretty awesome, or maybe a few things, guys. Who knows? All right, because things are slowing down for me, so I can create some really awesome things. Ooh, so we have some really fun Batman ones. All right, down for the Batman. Let's see what I can come up with. I would actually like to use each sticker pack is going to be the goal. We'll see what I do. And then we have some um, Avenger ones. Very cool. All right. Digging the Avenger ones. Here's the Avenger ones right here, guys. So there's those ones. Have to come up with some ideas for that. And last but, oh, these are cute. Oh, I love these ones. So we have another pack of Avengers ones. So my goal is going to be to use um, stickers from each four of these packs. So my goal is going to be to either make four crafts or a craft that involves all the stickers. That's my goal. So I might make one craft that involves all of these stickers. Might be what I do. We'll have to see. I don't know what I'm going to come up with, guys. I have tons of ideas. Go ahead and put your ideas in the comments below. I have some things that you would like to see me create with stickers. And yeah, this was super fun, Chad. I love this every single month. I look forward to it very, very much. All right, guys, let's go ahead and jump into the details and what items will be in the mini giveaway. Okay, guys, so before we get into the items for the giveaway, I'm going to go over some of the basic rules. First and foremost, YouTube is no way involved with or has anything to do with this giveaway. This is 100% on me, and I'm using this item that I've purchased with my own hard-earned money. Second, you have to be 18 years or older, and you have to live in the United States or have a United States postal address. This will not be opened internationally. And third, third or fourth? I don't know. Doesn't matter. You have to be subscribed to my channel, guys. If you're not subscribed to my channel, you will not be able to win. I will have a full set of rules in my description box below. Please make sure that you check that out prior to entering the giveaway. Okay, guys, I gotta say, I am probably gonna have trouble partying with some of the things in this giveaway because it's something that I personally like. So I'm going to go ahead and open it for you guys though. Let's see what fun stuff he has in here that I'm going to totally be jealous that somebody else is going to get. <laughs> okay, let's open this up. Okay. Um, he has it taped really good, but I want to show you guys so you guys can see what you're entering for. <laughs> Stop it. All right, guys, you guys, some lucky person is going to get this awesome cup koozie that is Superman. Check it out, you guys. This is a handmade item. A lot of work went into this thing. This is super awesome. And honestly, if I didn't say I was giving away to you guys, I would have kept it for myself. I'm just saying. So that is really awesome. Oh, stop it. Oh, oh my gosh. I can't stop. Oh, okay. So somebody is going to get a Batman lanyard. Look at that, you guys. I'm so jealous. I am jealous. I don't have this stuff. Chad, I don't have this stuff, and I'm super jealous right now. I'm just saying. And then we have, um, who is this, you guys? I'm not sure. Here, let me show it to you guys. There's a keychain. Who is that? Can somebody tell me who this guy is? I'm really not sure. Um, is it Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde? I don't know. So there you go. There's that. That's super fun. And then we have, oh, I can't tell. Here you go, guys. Here it is. I don't want to waste too much time so that you guys can kind of see what you're going to get. And um, there's a couple of other ones in here. So we have Superman. This is a job for Superman button. This is fun. Liking that button. I wouldn't mind having it for myself. And I don't know what this one is. So, oh, it's a Green Lantern. I could be wrong. I don't know, you guys. Here. Here it is. Tell me if I'm wrong. Probably could be. Um, yeah, but that's what I think. So we'll go ahead and put that stuff back in there. 
let's open this fun stuff up that I'm going to want to keep. I'm just saying I'm super, super jealous right now. Like, super, super jealous. I should have said there is no giveaway in this one. I'm going to keep all this for myself. Oh, this is fun. So this is paper. This is a paper clip. Um, I don't want to mess it up because you know what I did? Whoever wins this, you know what I did with mine? I have a Batman one. I put some clear tape around it so that it wouldn't poke through the paper. But this is like paper art and it's a paper clip of Wonder Woman. Very cool, but I would suggest doing that. That's what I did with mine. Somebody's going to get this awesome Wonder Woman patch. I can't tell you how jealous I am that somebody's going to get this. I am like extremely, extremely jealous. But somebody's going to get that. And then we have a Joker magnet. This is also a handmade item. Item. that is fun I mean the Joker is not fun but the magnets fun that's really cool then you're also going to get this awesome Wonder Woman postcard along with the postage stamp that comes with it so you can send somebody geeky hello could be me why not oh stop it I'm jealous like I'm so jealous you guys so somebody is going to get these awesome Batman stickers oh my gosh I should have kept this one for myself look how cool this is I should have totally kept this one for myself. I'm super jealous. Okay, guys, so that wraps up everything in this mini mystery box that is the giveaway. I'm going to pause for a second because I didn't look at the dates of when this is going to be available. Or actually, I'm not even going to pause, you guys. I'm just going to put it right here. So the giveaway is going to run from whatever I put here until whatever I put here. And I will announce the winner, whatever I put here. How's that sound, you guys? <laughs> I'll just do, do that part in the editing because I didn't have a chance to take a look at the calendar before I filmed this video because I was really excited excited to open this box. So that's all the information for the giveaway and the keyword for this one. Let's go ahead and use Batman. So use the keyword Batman in your comment below. That will let me know that you want to be entered in this giveaway. All right, guys, yet another super fun round of things from Chad for this month's box. I am very much looking forward to my next month. Chad, don't be giving them all this good stuff. Put this stuff in my box. I'm just saying. Me only. None of this is for them. I'm just teasing. All right, guys. Uh, that's all I got for you this time, and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye! My name is Amber Meeks, and in today's video, I have my... What month are we in? It's April, right? So this will be April's box. Yes. Yes. <laughs> So you guys just saw me unbox my March one last week, and uh, the April one came not long after that. What? Not long after I filmed that. I'm saying it wrong. Let's try it again. So we're going to go ahead and get this one unboxed today. I'm sure there's all kinds of fun goodies. We're going to do the cha um. Should I not film this? <laughs> try it again. So we're going to get this one unboxed today. I also will have the craft challenge results for the April, May. Hold on. For the April. What? Hold on. As I told you guys, I increased my Patreon support. So I'm going to have a giveaway in all of these videos each month. That didn't work. I was thinking and processing and it came off as I was doing that, as I was talking. Try to get this right. Try one more time. Okay, so I get this box from Crate Joy. I'm not sure if they're sold out on Crate Joy or not, but make sure that you always just go over and check periodically. Even if they're sold out, there may be a time when there's not. When there are not. <laughs> not taking this out. All right, let's open this up. Woo! We're starting right off with a Raiders of the Lost Ark. I can't think. I've got to do this again. I'm sorry. I have to do it again. I am so out of it. Or try it again. Okay, guys. So I know I look completely different from the way that I looked earlier in the video and later in the video. Well, I haven't done later in the video yet because it's going to be in between. Hold on. <laughs> we are going to go ahead and go over what Chad made for the May April. April. <laughs> er. <laughs> try it again as usual because I just want to hurry up and open the box. I'm so excited to see what's in there, but I want to save the craft items and uh, to, um, okay. Too, too much. Hold on. <laughs> okay guys. So I know I look way different. Okay. Hold on. 